Okay, cool. So what we'll do is let's start with screen sharing. You go, go I'm going to stop sharing, go ahead and screen share your end. Cause I'm going to walk you through everything on, on your end. We'll, and, and again, we'll focus today on, on the beginning, like the basics, like step one type of stuff. So go to Facebook. And then what I'm going to have you do also is I'm going to have you right there at the top. Are you on a PC or, or you're on a Mac? You're on a Mac. Do you, do you know, do you know a bookmark? Um, no, like, like, like different, um, on Mac, it's a little different. Like, I don't know where the hell you guys bookmark your pages. Like if you wanted to save a page, like, where oh, do you, I think we go up like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right there. How do you create a folder? Okay. Create a folder, create a folder. Let's see name. That's the page. Yeah. Facebook ads actually right there. Facebook ads manager. Did we start it last time? We did. And that was just like the business side. Um, I don't even know how to like open it. Oh, let's see here. It might be, it might be those three lines to the very right with that green arrow. Oh, here we go. Bookmarks. Okay. So we got, yeah, let's look at the ads manager one. Where the heck is it? Let's see. Right above. This one here. Yeah, no, the ads manager, like if you scroll down, ads manager. Oh, my bad. Yeah. Okay, so I think this is just a bookmark, but what we want is we want a folder because we're going to start, we're, I'm going to have you dump a bunch of different pages inside of the folder. So see if you can maybe go back to the bookmarks and, and see if you can create a folder. Bookmarks. Um, Let you, me go to. Oh, go ahead. Let, let's right click. Right click biz settings. Let's just delete everything. Delete biz settings. Delete um, one of the ads manager. Yeah, delete that one. Right click. Right click. You should be able to right click and, and delete. Sorry. Hit that drop down right there to the left, Canela. Hit that um, 261, that no up, that drop down right where it says your name down. That two six one two three, up. That drop down right there, right there. Yeah, click on that. Okay, so this is the only account you have. Okay, perfect. So then, let's um, let's. Okay, so what I'm gonna do this whole ads manager. This is where all the magic happens. Okay, this is where all the magic happens. Every Facebook ad is ran through here. Every Instagram ad is is ran through here. And you've ran some in the past, right? So do you know this stuff or what, or 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 not? Well, I, what I was doing was going on Instagram and like just promoting a post and that's what all this is. Gotcha. Okay. So now, now what, what I'm going to do is I'm going to position you to start running stuff to capture leads. Big difference. So, so, okay. So here's what we'll do. We're going to tear up this entire platform and just save all the most important tabs. That's step okay. one is just knowing how to navigate this thing and knowing where everything is at. And so that's why the folder is so important because at the end of the, at the end of the call, there's only a few things that you'll ever click on in this entire, on this entire platform. It yeah. seems so overwhelming, but there's only a few that you'll ever click on. Um, so this is the dashboard. And, and so you have it saved right now. Hit that star, that blue star up there at the top, hit that real quick. What did you name it? We want to be very specific. So name this one, name this one dashboard. Let's change that name ads manager. Yeah, this is the dashboard and then drop that folder, drop that down and put it in that correct folder. Say that you're breaking up. Say it again. Put it in the correct folder. So go ahead and hit that other bookmarks, that folder. Yeah. Put it in the down that um, other. Yeah. The, uh, right there. Yeah, but no, 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 no. Right there where it says other bookmarks. Okay. Sorry. Yeah, hit that drop down and then go into the Facebook ads manager. We're going to put everything in that folder. Okay. Done. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, cool. So now let's click on those dots to the very left, right below that home, that house image. Yeah. Hit that. Okay. So this is where it all starts. So this, where we're at right now is the dashboard. That's where we set up the actual ad, but there's so much, there's so much that goes on before you even get to this part. Um, mm -hmm. So first things first, we want to make sure we know our billing, like check on, click on the billing you always want to make sure you know your billing date and you always want to make sure you have the correct billing information because the last thing you want is some surprise charge from Facebook. Like you don't want that like at all at all. So hit, hit payment settings and let's just make sure we have the correct payment information on file and, and you know, your payment, your billing date. 
and we'll we'll bookmark this page over here as well. So this page right here. Okay, cool. So your your build every twenty nine. Just go ahead and click on yeah X out of that. So let's 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 pay, let's bookmark this page. Hit the star, and let's name this one billing. And then let's hit that folder and put it in in the right folder. Perfect. Under Facebook ads. Yes. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, so this is building hit done. So you're building every 29th. So what I always like to do is I like to, I like to start ads on the 30th. So mm -hmm. every 30th, I'll start, I'll start a new ad, a whole campaign. And, and the reason for it is because I don't get a bill until the end of the month, right? So, mm -hmm. so if I start on the 30th, I'm going to rock all of December and not have to pay that damn thing until December 29th. Nice. Smart. So, so. So because it, it's somewhat of a newer account, you may hit that manage right there, manage above the, the dollar, the zero, zero. Yeah, click on that. Let's, yeah, see, so you're at a $35 threshold. Now, as you make successful payments, that's one thing too. You all, that's why I spend time on this part and I have you bookmark this part because you always want to know your billing date and you always want to know your, you always want to have a good payment, in, a, a good payment method on file because Facebook is like a grading system. When that card declines, they kind of red flag you. And then they put a threshold on you. They'll either put a threshold on you when the, when the account is new and you haven't spent that much money, or they'll put a threshold on you when that card declines. Even if you update the card the next day and, and, and the payment is successful, it's still a red flag. And so I want that threshold to be, to be as high as possible. I'll always try to put that threshold at an amount that I know I'm probably not going to spend because I don't want bills every 35 bucks. Now you may like that, but, but I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to charge every 35 months. I want to rock the whole month and get one charge. What should yeah. I put it down? So put it at, put it at 900. I don't think you're, you're going to be able to get that high just yet, but just change it just, just in case. Yeah. So, so you may get a bill every $35 in, until a few transactions and then and then you'll be able to raise that threshold okay but but this is where you'll do it at this is where you'll do it at after a few 35 dollar transactions then yeah come back in here and try to raise it to 900 because 900 is an amount that you're never going to spend per month you're not going to ever spend that much anytime soon mm -hmm. so you don't have to worry about getting a bill every every few bucks because you'll never hit the 900 threshold you'll just get one bill a month okay you know, so, okay, so this part's saved. Okay, cool. So now let's click on pages to the left and let's make sure that your page, which one is your page? Is it the third one down? Mm -hmm. Okay, perfect. And then click on add accounts to the left. Okay, let's check this real quick. Okay, so that's the name of your ad account. If you ever run into issues with Facebook, like if your account is locked or if an ad gets rejected or if your account gets hacked for whatever reason, like if you ever need to reach out to Facebook, it's that number right there, that account ID number. That's the most important. So bookmark this page. That's like your ID number right there. That's your freaking driver's license number right there when it comes to Facebook. So name this one, add, add account ID. That two six one two three six zero six three. That's the most important number. Sorry, can we put the number in? Or no, no, you don't have to. Just put add a, add account ID. That's fine. Okay. Done. Perfect. Okay. Cool. So that's your that's that's like your driver's license number. So make sure you 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 hold on to that. Okay. So now let's click on let's click on the dots to the left or at the top right there the dots. Let's click on that. And then now we're going to go into, let's go into business settings. So let's make sure everything is, is up to date in the business settings. And the more information we can put in here, the, the better. So you're going with which account are you, are you going to, it's that one. okay, let's, let's rock with that one. So we may have to put the card again. Let's, let's double check or your PayPal. We may have to add that. So click on, click on pages right there okay cool so right here this is super important so this this business account is not tied to any business pages so let's add one we gotta we gotta connect it to yours so click on add and then add a page and then just type in your page right there and, and you should see the drop down 
Oh, so this one. Yeah, click on that one and then click on add page. And then you should, yeah, and then um, this page is currently owned by and linked with the next group. Add both now, entering, okay, so go to add all. Okay, so um, this site from opening two pop-ups. Okay, so hit, you gotta, yeah, you got you have, you have um, your, your blocker up or activated. Firefox prevented the site from opening two pop-up windows. So can you turn that off? I mean, I didn't know I was doing that, so. Yeah, hit preferences right there. Okay. Allow, allow pop-ups, yeah, allow. Okay. Okay, perfect. So you might have to put your, or yeah, continue if that's the account. Yeah, continue with that one. Third time's a charm. Is there any other password? The password. Um, you go ahead and hit close. Try it again. Yeah. Hmm. Go ahead and hit it at all. Sorry. Okay, yeah. there we go. Let's see. I'm trying to find where I can put. Like yeah, I, I think just. It's, I think it's but behind it. Try dragging this window out the way. Can you drag it out the way? Um. Try j just try hitting switch switch accounts and just just type in the actual yeah type it in type in the password. I don't remember. Um, let's see, where are you? Let's scroll. Let's go to business info. So this right here, trying to put in as much information as you can is, is always better. So, so the, the legal name, the address, um, you don't need to put your tax ID, but, but as much information as you can um, is, is better. Okay. Maybe under United United States, yeah, perfect. Perfect. Okay. Cool. Perfect. Perfect. Cool. Okay. So that's good. That's really good right there. Okay. Good. Okay. So scroll to the very bottom. Let's see if we have to verify an email. Scroll down, scroll down. Yeah. See, verify this email. So go ahead and click edit and then put your email in there and then, and then see if you receive a, an email. This right here is super, super important. And then, and then if anything, what you can do is, is verify the email from your computer, not from your cell phone. Like if you can pull up your, yeah, see if you can refresh it. And sometimes it takes a few minutes too. Like it don't always come right away, which is very weird. Yeah. Normally that's an automated email that goes out right away, but sometimes it does not. Okay. Huh? Do you think it might have been in you think it might have went to junk? Mm. 
No. Okay. Let me at least see if it's on my phone and then we'll just know the computer's running a little slow. Okay, so this is, so go scroll to the very top on the left, scroll to the very, very top and click on, click on users. Let's make sure your name is up in here. Click on people. Okay, so your name is right there. Perfect. And then- Are you telling me that I need to change it to my given name or at least D or something? Um, change it to what name? To, so my birth name is Deneen. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is actually based on your Facebook account. Is that your Facebook name? Yeah. Yeah, so that's that's pulling from your actual. I think you might, you might be able to edit it, edit right there. Click on edit, see if you can edit the name, but I know that that's actually, yeah, I guess you can. I guess you can. Should I go with Deneen or D? What Whatever. You? I mean, it's up to you. You're able to edit it, so you can change it for sure. Sorry. No, you're good. Okay, cool. Okay, so see if you got that email. But, but a custom audience is, again, let me, let me come back to, let me come back to my, my screen. So stop, share, come back to my screen. Okay, look, here's what a custom audience is. This is super, super important. Mm -hmm. When you're running a Facebook ad and, and, and I click on it, so I click on learn more, I come over to your landing page. My Facebook pixel is on this page. So this guy right here, Dan Henry, this is his Facebook pixel. So just like you have your pixel, everyone has a pixel. So here's your Facebook this pixel. Your client? To tell is you the truth, your... no, this ain't my client. To tell you the truth, this is my actual mentor. Oh, like I it's, love him. It's so funny that I'm actually seeing his ad because <laughs> this is my mentor. This is my number one guy. This is where I learn everything from. Nice. So, so, so here's what a pixel is. When I click on the ad and I come to the landing page, Here's the reality behind any ad. It doesn't matter what business you're in. It doesn't matter what kind of promotion you're offering. It does not matter. You're going to have X amount of people click, come to this page, and leave for whatever reason. Maybe, maybe I clicked on learn more. The ad got my attention. I clicked on learn more. I came over here. But maybe, maybe I couldn't enter my information because I was driving. Maybe mm -hmm. I couldn't enter my information because – my baby was crying and I had to go change her damn diaper. Maybe the food was burning. Maybe my wife was calling me and wanting to wring my neck out. I don't know. Things happen, right? Things happen. People click on stuff all day, come to the page, but don't fill it out for whatever reason. And they end up, they keep it pushing because our pixel is on the page. Facebook tracked them. Hmm. So what I'm able to do is I'm going to, I'm able to create a custom audience around everyone who landed here. Because if you saw my ad and you clicked on it and you came over to my page, but you didn't fill it out, there was some interest there for sure. Like you may not have had the time, again, you were driving, baby crying in the back seat, whatever. Like for whatever reason, you couldn't fill out the damn form, but you had to have some kind of interest for you to even click on the damn ad and get this far. Hmm. That's a yeah. custom audience. So, and so even audience, you say, Hey, so we saw that you were this close to yes, going out. Yes. Yes. Yeah. So because my pixel is on the page and because I set up a custom audience, I'm able to run an ad tomorrow. I'm able to run an ad an hour later. I'm able to run an ad a week later and say, Hey, Hey guys, I noticed you were on our webpage a few days ago. I know you, I know you were about to download your free massage coupon, but for whatever reason you didn't, we want to extend the promotion and just throw out another ad to you and let you know, hey, get back to our webpage because we're not going to have this promotion for much longer. So click learn more, go back to our page, fill out the form, and I'll email you that coupon right away. See you guys there. Like very targeted. Like we know that the damn person came here yeah. and, and, and just didn't fill it out for whatever reason. That's retargeting. That's a custom audience. It all happened because my Facebook pixel is tracking it and I'm able to categorize different people. 
Now here's another custom audience. So people who land here and leave, that's a custom audience of website visitors. Here's another custom audience. You're gonna have people that come here, fill out the form, and then come to the landing page. Come to the thank you page, excuse me. The first page is the landing page. The second page is the thank you page. This right here, the Facebook pixel is tracking it. This right here is categorized under a custom audience of quote unquote leads. Remember, we set up a custom conversion. We told Facebook it's the thank you page. This next page, the second page, this is the destination. This is what we told Facebook, the custom conversion, build it around this page. But those who also land here, I need you to customize those folks because the only person that will ever land here is a lead. Mm. So what I need to be able to do is I need to be able to put my pixel on this page, create a custom audience and name the audience leads. Whoever lands on this page is a lead. And why is that so important to have in its, to have in its own bucket, AKA custom audience? Because as I continue to run ads, I now need to be able to exclude that audience. If you've already downloaded your 50% your off your first massage coupon, you're not going to keep seeing my ad. You already downloaded it. So because I set up a custom audience and I know you landed here, I can then exclude you from ever seeing another ad which allows me to have my advertising costs down. I don't keep running the same ads to the same damn people who already opted in and got their coupon. Oh, wow. Right? So this is as basic as it gets and as powerful as it gets. Like this guy right here, Dan, I -hmm. saw his ad. I clicked. I entered my email. I came over here. Because he's such a smart marketer, he has his pixel on it. He's tracking it under a custom audience. So when he goes and runs his next ad, I won't be seeing it. I already opted in. I already down, I already entered my name and email. What do I need to see another ad for? Right? So, so that's how you segment different people, like in different audiences. That's right. how you, you keep your Facebook ad budget down. Right. Can you give me one quick moment, please? Oh, yeah, for sure. One quick second. here. The custom audience um, tab over here to the left is because our pixel is not on a page yet. So that pixel needs to be on something in order for us to create an audience. Do we need the Kartra stuff before our next meeting? Do we need like... I, 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 yeah, I would recommend it for sure. And I wouldn't recommend activating a 14 day trial until our next meeting. That way you don't eat up any other days. You know what I mean? So right. maybe on our next call, you can just, we'll, we'll, we'll do it together. We'll just activate a 14 day trial together. And okay. then, and then your 14 days will start from that, from that point on. Okay. But, but yeah, that, that's super important. And, and you want to, you want to, yeah, I mean, we want to in, in a four, in within the, four, within a 14 day trial, like we can be up and going with ads and capturing leads. Are you kidding me? Like, I'm not kidding. Like all within shit within seven days, like within a few days, like, and, and with the Karcher side, what you really paid for on the Facebook side is for me to teach you and hold your hand and walk you through all this shit, right? That's right. really what you paid me for on the, on the Facebook side. And we're going to take care of all this. We're gonna, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hit you from A to Z. I'm going to get you good. The Karcher side, all I need you to do is activate a 14-day trial and you got all my time for free. So I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm your Karcher guy. Like I'm going to be your landing page guy. I'm going to be your email guy. Like I'm going to teach you to run all that shit. And Karcher pays me the, the, affi- the affiliate commission. So I don't need to charge you. I'm good. So, awesome. but on the Karcher side, all I ask is that, is that we can record the calls and then I'll, I'll put those calls up on, on YouTube. Um, but Only I can get my makeup done. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Get your, and, 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 and to tell you the truth, to tell you the truth, I'm going to promote your business at the same time. So as I'm walking you through and doing, and, and we start doing tutorials for, I'll make sure that I'm on camera as well. We'll both be on camera because 
What I want to do with those videos as I teach you Kartra, I'm going to put them up on YouTube and I'm going to promote your shit at the same time. I want to put your links in the description. I want to shot you out. I want people, anybody in Arizona, anybody in Phoenix, come check my girl out. Like we're going to, I'm going to start plug. I'm going to start putting some plugs in for you like that. Like we'll do videos like that as I teach you Kartra. Sure. You know, so, so so Kartra is, is, is the, that's why the 99 bucks a month, it's, it's going to be worth it for you because the three main tools that you need when it comes to online marketing, any online, I don't give a shit if it's just Facebook, Instagram, whatever. If we're going to be running any ad on the internet, the three tools that I need, no matter what is a landing page, an email autoresponder and an online calendar. And that is included in the hundred dollars all in Kartra for 99 bucks. Those are the three things that you specifically need for your business. Those are the three, the three tools that I need for my business. Cause I take appointments too. So I need, and, and I'm not talking about, Hey girl, send me your email. I'll add me to I'll add us to our Gmail and I'll send you an invite and just accept the, no, I need you to go to my damn calendar, schedule that shit on your own. Yeah. Type of shit. You know what I mean? Like professional where you get a booking confirmation, you get a reminder right before our, our appointment, like that type of professionalism. That's an online calendar. Yeah. That's I card drive. Yeah. Okay. I need that. Cause people are like, like as you and I are zooming, I'm texting people to try to schedule their appointment and I'm over Yeah. That. Yeah. Yeah. All, see, you're manually micromanaging that shit. Yeah. I'm tired they, of it. They need too. to go to your calendar. All that needs to be automated. Like all that needs to be automated. If, if, if they can't schedule, then there's a link for them to reschedule. If they don't make their appointment, then you, there's a button you click on inside of Kartra that cancels out the appointment, sends them an email and gets them to reschedule. Do you require if, if, well, I would like to require deposits. Is that something that Kartra can do? Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah. Through your appointment, through your calendar. Hell yeah. You could charge for your class. Hell yeah. Okay. And that, and that charge goes through Kartra. Like you'll have to set up a, well, actually you have PayPal. So, so you right. can. No, I inter- meant, uh, yeah, no, I meant like, say somebody wants to come in and get a, a Brazilian wax. Yep. Yep. Put, oh, okay. I thought you meant, because like, I got, I want to teach this. After you have gotten me well acquainted with it, I am nowhere. I did tell a few businesses to hit you up. They're like, no, I'll wait for you. And I'm like, well, bitch, that's going to be a couple of years. So <laughs> <laughs> no, it's all good. No, that, that the way the Kartra calendar is, is, is set up is I can charge per call. I can charge per appointment. I can charge per session. Yeah, dude. Yeah. Like all that is done through Kartra. Dope. 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 Yeah. 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 Well, really, really cool. So you, you can ask for a deposit for sure. Yeah, you would prefer me to wait or just do the 99? Like you said to do it on the 30th. Is that what you were saying? No, 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 no. Your Facebook ads run from the 29th to the 29th. So, I mean, if anything, you know, shit, it's up to you. I mean, what what are we at? We're at the freaking 16th or whatever. Like we could start ads in the next few days if you wanted to. All I was talking about was was Facebook. Yeah, if 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 I'm running ads, I'm I'm starting on day one, which would be the 30th, for for example. Okay. Which will give me the whole month until I'm billed with Facebook. But with Kartra, there's a 14 day trial. Oh, so okay. I'd hate for you to start the 14 day trial today and you and I don't speak for another four days. No. Yeah. No, no. You know no. what I mean? Like, I'd rather us, whenever we get another appointment scheduled here, let's start the Kartra on that day. Okay. Okay. So whatever, whenever you're ready for another call, like, because this whole call was to bookmark everything. So let, let, so we got this part bookmark. We, we were supposed to bookmark our custom audiences, but, but we're not, we won't be able to right now. And that's fine. But click on the dots to the left. Let's see if there's anything else that we need to bookmark real quick. So click on those dots. And then, so we got, we got the events manager, which is our pixel. We got the ads manager, which is our, the actual dashboard, our business settings, we, we got all that, but you got to change your password for Instagram and then, and then go back into the business settings and click on pages and then click on add. So remember to do that. If, can you give me one second? I'm going to see if I can find it um, for us. Yeah. So scroll down on the left. Let's see if there's anything else we need to bookmark. We pretty much have everything. So let's, so let's look at, let's look at, yeah, scroll all the way down to the very, very bottom. Is there anything? That's all. Okay. What is this so, commerce manager about? Commerce manager, that's if you're selling stuff online. So if you have like, a, like an actual store, like an online store, then that's where you can, you can start doing different marketing for your store, like to sell physical products. Right. So like the soaps that I have would be something under here? If you have an actual website where you're selling those soaps from, 
Yeah. Oh, okay. I need to get on. Okay. Okay. And, yeah. and, 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 the, and, and a good platform would be Shopify. Shopify. Okay. Yeah. Shopify is, is a, is a online type of website platform that allows you to sell physical products and, and, and keep it easy. Like okay. it's the most easiest platform to sell physical products. That's helpful. Okay. Yeah. So, and it's, and it's not that expensive. It's like 29 bucks a month, 30 bucks a month for the entire online platform. And you can sell whatever the hell you want from it. I love that. Yeah. So I'll help you with that part in the future for sure. But is there a way we can get back to our folder? Like how do we check our folder? Like what's in that ads manager folder? So mm. click on that to the very right, that, that drop down to the right. Yeah. Right there. What is that? Can we open it from there? Um, uh, damn it. I don't know how to get to your folder. I just want to be able to look at everything that's in there. Um, and then I can have, you know, different calendars. This is my main calendar right here. So I click on edit. I come into the actual settings of it all. And then um, I can change the aesthetics of it. Like I can add a banner, I can add my logo, like a picture or whatever. Like I can add the little header logo. I can add um, a custom background image. So the background image of the actual calendar. Um, and then the time zone, I just, I just kind of let, I, I leave it at this one, let your users select their respective time zone. So I just leave it at that. And that's what it is at default. So I just leave that and then save a next. And then in here, this is where I can name the, the, the title of the, of, the, of the session, the description, and then my name and then all my hours. So I can choose a session. I can go, I, can, I could take appointments every 30 minutes. I could take appointments every 15 minutes, whatever. You know, I just do it every hour. Um, and, then, and, then I, and then right here, this is the only time you'll have to see it in military time um, is when you're setting up the calendar. And so I can, I can, you know, choose my, my, my schedule, my day, and all I'm doing right here, the reason why you don't see it is because I, the way I have mine set up is I only have it booked out for a few days because in my business, I don't want people coming to my calendar and booking a call for December 19th. You feel me? Oh, like, it's like, I need that. Ur I have that urgency. Like I only have a few days open. Like when I'm talking to people, it's like, it's Monday. I'd say, Hey, go to my calendar. Shit, man you only got till Thursday. So book a call in between, book a call tomorrow. You know, you know what I mean? So it's like only cause I have that urgency. Like I like to create that urgency, a person that if it's November 16th and they're trying to book now in your business, it's different because people, especially if you're charging people a deposit, like they're going to take that appointment seriously. Right. And sometimes in my business, people will forget. Like if you book appointment freaking December 20th, like you're going to forget, even though my system is going to email you a reminder Mm -hmm. shit happens. I don't like booking appointments out that far. So, so I just kind of keep it tight. You know, I keep it tight and that's just me, but in this it. case, I'm going to open it up. Thank you. So, so I'll open it up and just go ahead and, um, go ahead and, and, and refresh that page and then you'll, you'll see the new time. And then I'll walk you through all this later. I'll, I'll take you through a full blown tutorial of all this stuff. And I guess a few more questions about the card show then. If I'm overstepping boundaries, by all means, say so. No, you're uh, not. Well, what I'm about to ask you. What, and you don't have to be specific, but even just a really a good range would help me. Mm -hmm. How much money could one make by? Eight figures. Okay. Yeah, eight figures. I'm going to take, I'm going to take this entire, I'm going to, my whole plan is to take my business to 20 plus million. But that's selling coaching. That's see, Kartra is the one software in Kartra. I have a membership course, and in my membership course that I'm almost done with, everything I'm doing with you, D, it's a, it's a, um, no, no disrespect. Like I love you. Like you're my yeah. girl. But you're my guinea pig. You're my guinea pig. I'm gonna yeah, keep it real. I'm gonna keep it real. You're my, you're my, you're my, um, you're my, you're you're my, um, my my test pilot. You're my, you're my freaking. You're, you're the client that I'm taking you through these five steps to really solidify them and to really make sure that this is what the market needs. And then once I, once I take you through these five steps and, and help you be successful, then I package it all up. I put it all in video form. 
and I sell that. Wow. So that's this membership course that I'm going to be selling in January. Uh, hopefully I'm, I'm able to launch it. I'm almost done, but I have 55 videos in this training course teaching people everything I'm about to teach you and more and more because Kartra and, and more everything I'm about to teach you and more is, is all wrapped up into about 50 videos, 55 videos in this course that I'll be selling for 1497. Amazing. And I want to be selling five to six to seven of them a day all through Facebook ads. Okay. So what if you were a massage therapist, right? Yep. Would you be selling, would you be doing anything with Kartra or would you strictly working on the service industry? No, with Kartra, it, I would need landing pages. I would need my email autoresponder and I would need my online calendar. You keep saying that. I don't know why I'm not getting it. Thank you. Yeah, that, that's all for any business, for any business. I'm just showing you my, my course. I'm just showing you like a, like a coaching program that, that I'm going to be selling inside of Kartra as well. But, but other than that, this is what every business needs. Every business needs a landing page, an email autoresponder, and an online calendar. That's it. So I guess my, my question is, if you owned 1111 Wax Studio and Spa, yep. and you're about to put it through this process like I'm about to do for my, yep. myself, how much money te would you say I could make? I, don't, I couldn't be eight figure, because I don't have an eight figure body to be work, working that much. Yeah, exactly. You don't have, you don't have that type of, 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 of manpower as far as employees. You know, like you couldn't take on that type of, of traffic if you wanted to right now. So, so in a perfect, perfect world, you can have every hour booked. So whatever your schedule is, every hour can be booked through a Facebook ad and your Karcher account. Every hour of the day is booked. Mm. So, so whatever that, that looks like to you, if I'm open from nine to five, every hour is booked and every appointment is coming in through my Facebook advertising. Every appointment is being booked through my Karcher calendar. Every person's clicking and going to my Karcher landing page. All these leads are getting emails from me on a daily basis through my Karcher email autoresponder. I need to kill this, man. I've, I've wasted a lot of so, years growing other people's businesses. Yeah, it's all good. You, we, yeah, we're, we're, we, 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 hit, we, we hit the jackpot. We're here. We're here. And I'm your last person. You're my last person. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> coaching and holding people's hands because it's just time consuming. It's time consuming for everyone. And, and that's not how you scale a business. Like you have to eventually see here, here's the next level for you. Here's yeah. the next level for you. The next level for you is to master Facebook ads and Kartra, start capturing leads, start generating business, start documenting that. And then what you would do is you would turn around and start creating simple videos teaching me how you did that from the Facebook ad, from the targeting to setting up your cart or landing page to the emails that go out to the coupon and the way it was designed to the way you set up your calendar. You put all that into 15 videos all in here, the membership side of Kartra. Those 15 videos are teaching people exactly how you marketed your salon spa business. What I would do after that is I would start running Facebook ads and start selling my knowledge to other people who own spas and salons. Will you, this might be a lot to ask in the moment, but will you be there for those steps as well? Is that something I'm a, that you- I'm gonna be here to the freaking, to, to, to I don't, what's that saying to the freaking to the, fat lady to the fat lady sings. I'm going to be here. I'm going to be here. Like it's in my best financial interest to help you succeed with Kartra, to help you keep yeah. Kartra. Like my monthly residual income. Here's what, here's what my deposit was today from Kartra. And that's not even from you working. It's from other people. This right here is simply by having a handful of people that are using Kartra every month. I love it. And that's a monthly deposit that, that just keeps increasing. Like every month it increases. This is the highest because every month it increases next month, they'll probably be 1500. And that's not a whole lot of money right now, but it's, it's, it's reoccurring. Yeah. But do you realize how many massages I've had to bust my ass for? Just oh, to I know, get I know, I know, I know. And even me, you know how many clients I got to close to even try to make that. So it's like, that's what I'm in this for. So I want to make sure that you're successful, successful with Kartra 
So you keep Kartra, so your business explodes, my business explodes, and this is just one of my income streams. I, 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 I love this income stream. This is an income stream that, that every first of the month, I start with that money. Yeah, you know? I love that. You know, so- Oh my so God, I'm so excited. Yeah, that, that's- And I'm glad I'm your last. I'll be the most memorable. I'll be your best student, I pray. Dude, I'm a freaking, you be your client. Shit, are you kidding me? I'm gonna be out there, <laughs> I'm gonna be out there once a month. Please do. I ain't playing. I am not Getting playing. Right. I am not playing. So book the next appointment for sure. And then we got to get our Kartra. Don't go to Kartra.com. Don't do anything. I'm going to send you my link so you can sign up under my link. And okay. then, and then we'll, we'll go from there, but try to schedule it as soon as you can. Yeah. Well, we already, I already did on uh, the 23rd awesome. at 3 PM. Perfect. 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 Well, on that, on that day, we'll set up the Kartra. We'll, and we'll, we'll finish the Facebook ad site the custom audiences, installing the pixel, and even setting up a whole new app. Okay. But, but what, okay, so here's your homework. Here's your homework. Here is your homework. Here's your Thank homework. You. I got the perfect homework for you. I'm ready. Your homework is going to be to come up with different promotions. And I'm talking about simple promotions, something that I can scroll through my newsfeed and see and say like, damn, I need that. Okay. Whether, whether it's a discount off my first massage whether it's my first 30 minutes free, some type of enticing promotion. We, okay. need, we need to think of a few of them, not just one, think of a few of them. Things that you can afford, not anything you're giving away, you know, where it costs you. Well, obviously everything's gonna cost you. If you're giving away a discount, it's costing you. If you're giving me time for free, it's costing you, obviously. But, but something that makes sense, you know, for you. You know what I mean? Nothing that's gonna break the bank and, you know. My back. Yeah, yeah. Like, <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. So think of, think of a few enticing promotions. That's number one. And then number two, number two, here's your second piece of homework. Mm -hmm. And it's, and it's going to consist of a video. It's going to consist of a video. Now it's not going to be a video for everyone to see. It's not a video ad, but it is going to be a video. It's a, it's going to be a video that goes on the thank you page. So as we get to, let me go back to, um, to this landing page. So as I see your Facebook ad, and I click on it and I come over to your landing page and I click on the button to enter my name and email. I click download my coupon. Now I then go to the thank you page. This video is what I want you to produce. This is a simple ass video you can do on your laptop, a simple ass video you can do on your cell phone, pull out your cell phone. But whenever you're doing video on your cell phone, always hold the phone horizontal. Okay. Not vertical oh. verticals for Instagram for, for video, for Facebook and for, for YouTube, for example, it's horizontal, hold that phone wide, widescreen. Okay. Okay. Here's the simple video for this video, for this, for this page. This is the thank you page. So this is the person that came here. They enter their name and email. They want your shit. They download it. They submit, they click the button, they land here. That needs to be a video of you. Here are the okay. four things that you're going to touch on okay. and just try to knock this video out. Try, try your best. If you got to do it 15 times, do it 15 times. I know you can do this video. You look good. You have the professionalism. You have the knowledge. You are the shit. Like you can Thank do this you. video. You can do this video. Here's the four things that you're going to hit on. Again, it's after they download your coupon, they land here. Number one, bullet point. Number one is you're obviously thanking them. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for downloading my 25% off your next massage coupon. This is a coupon that I'm very, very excited about. This is something we're running for the month of November and we're fired up just thanking them. Right. I'm just, I'm just extending my gratitude. I'm, I'm, I'm just thanking, 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 thanking. That's number one. Thank you for downloading your, 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 your discount. Number two, I'm introducing myself. My name is D. I've been a professional for the past 15 years. I love what I do. I'm excited. We're out here in Phoenix, Arizona, blah, blah, blah. Number two, I'm introducing myself. Okay. Number three, I'm telling them to check their email. Check your email because I just emailed you your discount code. You're going to click on the link and you're going to be able to download your coupon right away. Okay, so that's number three. Check your email. And then also make sure you check for future emails because what we do over here at 1111 Wax Spawn Studio is we like to have promotions all the time. So as we roll out new promotions for the new year, guess what? Because you guys are now on our email list, you're going to be, you're going to have first dibs. So whenever we run out and roll out a new promotion, you guys are going to be the first ones that we email it to. So make sure you check for my emails in the near future, open up every single one of them. You're not going to want to miss one. So, so something like that, you know, number three, 
check your email because I just emailed you your coupon and also check for future emails because we have a lot of shit coming on our pipeline. You're not going to want to miss out. That's number three. And then number four, number four, click the button below to schedule your massage now. So number four, I'm, I'm, I'm creating urgency. I'm saying, hey, man, we are at the end of the year or, hey, we, we're, we're at the beginning of the year. And this is when our shop is the fullest and packest and everybody wants to come in for the new year. So to make sure that you, make, that you get your, 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 your desired appointment, click the button below. It'll take you straight to our calendar where you can schedule your best time. Love it. So number four, I'm creating urgency and saying, hey, man, schedule that shit now. Don't wait. Okay. And how long should this video be? It, it don't got to be that long. 60 seconds. Like as, as long oh. as it takes you to fit, fit all them four points in. Okay. A minute, two minutes, the longest. I mean, not, not long at all. Something simple on your, on your, do it in your bedroom, do it at, at, at the shop, at the salon. Like, like keep it simple, keep it simple and have fun with it. The okay. fact that that's you on video is, is what, is what seals the deal. Okay. You have to know that you have to know that. And I tell it to people all the time when I'm consulting with people, I say, dude, the only reason why you're here is because you keep seeing my mug on YouTube. <laughs> you keep seeing my damn face on YouTube. If it wasn't for you seeing me visually, you wouldn't be here. Yeah. So it has nothing to do with how you look. It has nothing to do with your hair, your makeup, your nails done that day. It had nothing to do with none of that stuff. It's the fact that that's you. That's what makes it real. Okay. That's, that's, that's good stuff. So, so, so if I can see you on that thank you video, I'll be like, damn, okay, shit, they're doing it. Okay. Let me schedule this appointment now. But what most people do is they'll take me to a generic ass page. Yeah. There ain't nobody there. Right. It's like, it's dead. It's like, there ain't no personality to that at all. Like I need you to shine. I need you. This right here is where you have that person's attention right away. So, so make the best of it. Like whoever lands here is a lead. Make that bitch schedule now. <laughs> you know <I> will. <laughs> okay so so i'm excited for you man i really am I, I i we have a learning there's a learning curve but but this is all the back end the facebook ad the back end the kartra the landing page the email automation the calendar it's all the back end this is all the heavy lifting up front but once we once we once we learn all this shit it becomes a machine and all we gotta do is pour gas into that damn machine and pouring gas into the machine is running a facebook ad if you can keep an ad going consistently throughout the month, people are going to be coming into your world. And that's just what it is. It is what it is. Like the machine, this is all the back end machine. We just got to feed it, you know? So we'll learn this, man. We'll learn this for sure. And, and I'm excited for you. Uh, thank you. Yes, D, for sure. So let's yes. chat, let's chat the 23rd and then, and then we'll go from there and let me know, oh. message me in the meantime, if you need anything else. You got it. I will. Thank right, you D. so much, David. You're so, great. so welcome. God bless. Talk to you soon. Thank you. Bless you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.